Well, I wanted to try something a little bit different tonight. It's related to the holiday that Cantor Emma just mentioned, Tuba Av. And what I'm going to ask you to do, and those joining at home, just get real comfortable. And it's easy for a lot of folks here at uh, Crescent Bay Park because some of you are already sitting down in comfortable chairs. If you have a mat, you can just lie down if you want. That's okay. We're going to do a short meditation. If you fall asleep, it will not be the first time that I put someone to sleep in one of my sermons. Some people who have sleep problems, just they, they'll turn on the YouTube uh, you know, channel of my sermons and it, and it does the trick. So just get comfortable and we'll try to get a little bit quiet and there are noises around us. That's okay. No problem. You might hear some of the beach noise or maybe a bird or a child playing. That's okay. And if you want, you can close your eyes. Some people find that really helpful. And we're just going to do a short meditation that relates to this theme of the movement from Tisha B'Av to Tu B'Av that Cantor mentioned earlier and that that psalm references sowing in tears, reaping in joy. And it's this belief that life has these circles and there are moments when we're on the down and there are moments when we come back up. And this is called a befriending meditation and the focus is on shining love out which is one of the teachings of Tu B'Av, that we can bring redemption into the world through our kindness to others, through our friendship to others, and through our love. So I'm going to invite everybody to get nice and quiet, find a place to be comfortable. And like I said, if you want, you can lie down. But I want you to be comfortable. And if you like, you can close your eyes. And this is about cultivating kindness and friendship towards yourself and others as an act of redemption to try to bring love into the world so that whereas Tisha B'Av is about senseless hatred, sinat chinam, destruction, discord, division, Tu B'Av is about ahavat chinam, loving other people for no other reason than because it's good to be loving. Not because they earned it, not because you owe them, but because you want to shine love out into the world. So we're going to start because if we want to be loving people, we have to have self-love. We have to care for ourselves. So we're going to take a moment to wish ourselves well, and then we're going to extend this wish to others. And I want you to think about this intention. May I be safe and free from suffering May I be as happy and healthy as it is possible for me to be. May I have ease of being. May I be safe and free from suffering. May I be as happy and healthy as it's possible for me to be. And may I have ease of being. And if you want, you can imagine each of those phrases almost like a pebble drop down a deep well. You drop the pebble and you listen for a response for a thought, a feeling, something inside of yourself. With your eyes closed, think about what it means to be safe and free from suffering. What it might mean to be happy and healthy. And what it might mean to know ease of being. And now we're going to turn our attention to others. I want you to think about a person who loves you unconditionally. Maybe you could think about a pet who loves you unconditionally, a parent, a friend, a teacher. And when you have a sense of their love for you, see if you can offer that love right back to them. And you're offering, you're offering that to this person who loves you and to yourself as well. May they be safe. May I be safe. May they be happy and healthy. May I be happy and healthy. May they know ease of being. May I know ease of being. You can bring to mind another loved one, a dear friend, a parent, a child, a spouse, a student, a teacher, and keep that person's image, that person's essence in your mind as you ask that they be safe and free from suffering that they be happy and healthy, 
that they may have ease of being. And now we come to the hardest part of this kavanah, this intention. So we're going to think of someone who is difficult, someone that you might be feeling distant from right now, someone with whom you might even be in conflict with. And yet, it is still possible, even with the person with whom you are having difficulties, it is possible and even beautiful to wish for them that they be safe and free from suffering, that they be happy and healthy, that they have ease of being. This isn't about becoming best friends or feeling a sense of warmth and love towards them. Right now, it's enough just to hold the intention in your mind that they might be safe and free, happy and healthy, and no ease of being. And finally, we're going to extend loving kindness, this spirit of Tuba Av, the holiday we celebrated two days ago, a holiday that our tradition teaches is a time of unity for all Israel, and we could let that ripple out. If we could know unity ourselves, maybe we could shine that unity out to all other peoples. And so now we're going to try to extend loving kindness to all beings, our loved ones and friends, strangers, and even those we might find difficult. And we remember that all beings includes ourselves as well. May all be free from pain and suffering. May all be happy and healthy. May all of us have ease of being. And this befriending meditation, which is used in lots of different traditions of meditation and reflection, maps on so beautifully to our priestly blessing, which we find in the Book of Numbers which we read just about a month and a half ago, two months ago. Yevarechecha Adonai v'yishmerecha. May God bless you and keep you with a life that's free from pain and suffering. Ya'er Adonai panave lecha v'chunecha. May God be gracious to you. May God be kind to you and grant you health, happiness. And may God Give you the greatest gift of all. shalom. May God grant you peace, ease of being. May God grant you shalom. Adonai May God bless you. May God keep you. May the light of the Holy One shine on May God's face be lifted up to you Lifted up to you May God grant you the precious gift of peace Yeah, 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 yeah.